Okay, hello there, and welcome to my instructions on how to craft in Minecraft and prepare our Oregon Trail journey. So, uh, you're looking at my, well, of course, my edited post here in Kid Blog, which I will publish, but it looks something like this. You'll get the idea. First thing you're going to do, of course, you've already clicked here for the instructions, and you've already read the objective, I'm sure, as well, too. Uh, you're going to click here to get to a crafting website, and this is a Minecraft crafting website. So it looks like this, minecraftcrafting.net. Uh, really cool stuff here. It's got all of the different things that you can craft in Minecraft, I believe. Yep, it looks like it even has all the 1.8 stuff. So all of this stuff in the latest version. Um, and then all you have to do is you just simply click on this, like here, wood planks. I just click on it, and it shows me right here. Boom, that's how I do it. I put a wood block, and I get the wood planks. So uh, This is the website that you're going to use to uh, pick your 12 items that you're taking on your Oregon Trail unit and also how you're going to um, uh, write down what you need for that because you're going to have to get some supplies to create some of these things, okay? So, um, first things first, we are going to be taking our, in, our information we grab from this website and we're going to be creating a spreadsheet on this. So my instructions today pretty much are how to build and work in a spreadsheet. Uh, and then, like I said, you'll be using the information from this website on your spreadsheet. So, let's get to a spreadsheet. Um, first thing you'll need to do is you'll have to open up a new tab. And you're going to go to Apps. And Google Drive. That's how you're going to get to it. Google Drive. Okay. So, boy, it's slow. There it goes. Um, once you get to Google Drive, you're going to say New... Google Sheets, just like that. Okay, so let me review what I just showed you, and I'll have you pause the video, and I'll have you go do that, catch up with me, and then I'll show you how to start working on your spreadsheet, okay? So first things first, in KidBlog, we click here, click here for the crafting website, get this website, boom. Then we open up a new tab, go to Apps, Google Drive, and we go New Google Sheets, okay? So I want you to go ahead and do those steps. So you should have four tabs open. You should have Minecraft Crafting Guide website, Kid Blog. Oh, actually, you should have five because you'll have my screencast as well. And then the Google Drive and the spreadsheet open. So go ahead and do that. Pause the video. Come back and see me. Well, you're not really seeing me, but you can come back and listen to me some more, and I'll tell you how to use this spreadsheet and do it. So see you in a bit. All right, so hopefully you've caught up with me. You have your five tabs open, uh, and you're ready to go. So a spreadsheet is really a whole bunch of columns and rows, and it's an excellent way of creating lists or and keeping it orderly and fashioned and, and keeping things in their own spots, lining them up perfectly. Uh, and so it works really well with what we're going to be doing. So like I said, we're going to be... Um, picking some Minecraft items out that we might want to take with us on a journey out west, just like the old Oregon Trailers did. Um, Oregon Trailers, I don't think that's a real word. Uh, anyway, so first things first, we need to name this, because right now we have Untitled Spreadsheet, and that's very unoriginal. So let's click on that, and let's name this. Um, we can name it like Oregon Trail Crafting Guide. That's pretty cool. Yeah, Oregon Trail Crafting Guide, okay? So you can say, okay, if you want to pause the video, go do that and come back. That's fine. Go ahead. I'll wait. All right, so you're back. Um, this is named good. Now we're going we're gonna to start with um, what we're going to call them column headers, okay? So this is going to be like the name of what each of these columns is, okay? So because we have a whole bunch of information here, and we want to put on there exactly what we want. So the very first thing you're going to say, like right here, is this is going to be the item, Okay, so we're going to list the item underneath. So this column right here is going to have the name of every item we're taking with us. Okay, so for instance, if we want to do wood, if we want to take wood with us, wood planks, okay, that's what we'll put. So in our spreadsheet, we would say wood planks. Okay, kind of makes sense now? All right. Um, all right, so, this, so we just say item first, okay? Now, this column here is going to be a little bit bigger, okay? Because you have to justify. Why are you taking this item with you on the Oregon Trail? So I want to show you a couple of things. We named this one. We left it the same size. Um, now, if it's the reason, so we're just going to say reason. Let's keep it simple. Reason, okay? Reason. Now, this little teeny tiny box here is not near big enough for you to tell me why it is that you need to take wood with you on your trip, right? 
So what we're going to do is, when you see how I put my mouse up here, it changes to little arrows going back and forth. Well, I can click and drag this as big as I want to, and I'm probably going to go over about four cells like that. Boom, like that. Now it makes this nice and long, so I can type in a longer response. Okay, I can go five if I really wanted to, but um, and I'm going to show you another thing here that's going to make this a little bit wider here in just a second. So, item first, reason second, drag it four columns wide, let it go, boom, got that. So we have our item, we have our reason, okay, that we're taking this with us, and then this is what we're going to need to craft it, okay? So um, let's just say need. Does that make sense? Yeah, need, need. We need these things to craft this item, right? So we have this item. Uh, my example was, of course, wood planks. What do I need for wood planks? Well, I need wood chunks or I need wood blocks, okay? So um, as, I, as I do my examples here, this will make more sense. So, so far we have item, we have reason, we have need. Um, I think that might be it. I may come up with another column here after a bit. Why don't you pause the video, go ahead, and do those three columns. So we have item, we have reason, we have need. And then, of course, remember, make reason big, because I want to know lots of good answers for that. Okay, so go pause the video, go do that. We'll come back, we'll start doing some examples, okay? Alrighty, so hopefully you've caught up with me. If you haven't caught up with me, then you didn't pause the video and go do that. So pause the video and go do that. But if you have caught up with me, good for you for listening. Let's go back to this website here. So yeah, here we have lots and lots of stuff here, right? Okay, so I might want to, let's say, oh, let's just stick with wood. Let's just be plain Jane and normal and say wood. Yep, I want to take wood planks with me. Uh, so here we are, wood planks, right? Um, back to my spreadsheet. I'm going to put my item name in. So I'm going to say wood planks. And let's spell it right, Mr. Meyer. Be a good example. Very good. Reason. Why do I want to take wood planks with me? Mm, well, I might need to build a quick shelter. And I'm going to make this a long answer so I can show you what happens when it goes past this so i'm going to kind of ramble on here so hang with me as i ramble okay so i'm going to need, might need to build a bit quick shelter and i like wood it is so pretty do not type in stuff like this please that's not a good answer but i told you i'm rambling right so uh, it's so pretty and it sticks oops together oh my goodness look at this i went over i'm into my needs column now oh my gosh what's gonna happen well i'll show you this see this little button right here it has lines 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 with an arrow down wrap text if i click that watch what happens boom it makes this bigger so this is what i want to do click on the b so this whole thing is highlighted and then click this button right here boom and then that means all of them will do that automatically so i don't have to do that every single time so awesome so fantastic you may need to do it with the needs too, because some of these, um, of course, take several things first, right? Okay, so uh, this is pretty good stop, stopping point. Let's pause. Let's pause. Go do that thing. So, pause. Uh, maybe do your first one or whatever, and then, um, like I said, click on B, wrap text, so it all does that. Okay. Um, oh, before I do, I should finish this. So yeah. So need, need. Uh, to craft wood planks, what do I need? Uh, I need one block of wood. Okay, so what do I need? Block of wood. Okay, very good. Um, I think in this column I might need something else over here, but... Nope, nope, I'm not going to do it. not going to do it. I'm just going to leave these three columns. So let's just leave these three columns. Wood planks is what I'll say. I need to build a quick shelter and much better answer than this normally. And then what do I need? I need a block of wood. Okay, does that make sense? So let's do that. Let's go. Um, do your 12 items. So now you're not going to stop at 12 because look at here. Number one was our column headers. So if you have 12 items, you're actually going to go to number 13. That's confusing. I'm asking you to do math. So 13 is where you need to go to. I want 12 things. Now, talking about these things here. Hmm, okay. Um, bricks. Do I need bricks on my trip to the Oregon Trail? Mm, no, you're having a hard time convincing me of that. Glowstone, mm, I have a hard time convincing me of that, okay? Uh, some tools, sure. Yeah, well, you need an axe, possibly. Yeah, that's pretty good. I think I maybe take a shovel. Yeah, maybe. A pickaxe, perhaps, yeah. Are you going to be making them out of diamond? No, you are not building stuff out of diamond. All of your tools are going to be wood, 
keeping it simple, keeping it easy, and you're not going to be building, digging, chopping, cutting, any of those things for very long or very much at all, either in this lesson. So that's not the important part. The important part is we're getting our items that we're going to be taking with us, and that's it, okay? Uh, so like redstone stuff, mm, don't need it, don't need it, it's not going to have it. Pistons, mm -mm, don't need them. Those are things that probably aren't going to be useful for us in our Oregon Trail journey, okay? Armor and swords and weapons and horse armor. Uh, this is going to be something I'm sure tons of you are going to say, oh, I need this stuff because I'm a Minecraft player and a Minecraft player needs armor. True, true that. I will guarantee you, yes, if you're playing Minecraft, you need those things. We are not playing Minecraft. We are going on an Oregon Trail journey using computer software called Minecraft. So do we need armor and swords and bows? Probably not. Um, maybe a bow, I guess, if you want to do some hunting, perhaps, possibly might be some hunting on our trip. I can get that, sure, but our Oregon Trail people did not take swords on their journey. So let's keep this kind of accurate, okay? Um, yeah, so a lot of these things down here in the bottom, probably not going to be taking a uh, lead, yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe. Uh, but some other things here, you know, that are... are appropriate i think you can come up with 12 appropriate things to be taking you know thinking of building things shelter things uh think back to your unit on what people would take and what they would need you know those sorts of things uh compass would be a good thing we're traveling right a map might be a good thing possibly okay a bucket would be a good thing uh shears flint and steel flint and steel might be a good thing because you might need to start a little campfire on the way so that could be something that you go shears i don't know about that one fishing pole good idea you know some of these other tools here so there's lots of different things here uh the boat you know lots of things that you could think of i'm sure that oregon trailers would be taking so come up with 12 figure this out so let's get into like a little hard ones here sorry sorry for my rambling um i'm gonna click on this furnace so you see my furnace it shows me how to craft right it shows me my yield so for my furnace here's what i get this is what I'd need. I would need this many pieces. If you don't know what these item blocks are, well, you can ask either a friend sitting next to you, or you can ask me, because I know everything about Minecraft. Everything. Every last thing. All right, so go ahead. Let's, um, gosh, I think that might be the end of our video here, actually. Let's just go ahead. Yeah, why don't you just go ahead and do that? Work on your 12 items. Let's get your 12 items finished up. Um, yeah, and then I'll show you the next step. In, a, in another video because otherwise you'll just kind of forget where you left off at so that sounds pretty good so get started here might not get this done today that's okay uh work on it we'll work on it next time so um go ahead carry on